Oh yeah, I got the banners right as well. Uh, so a big shout out again to Coffee Fuel Gaming. He was the dude that made the trailer. Much appreciated. And hopefully you guys enjoy that trailer as well because it's pretty cool. Is it too loud, by the way? I asked this before, and then if I got to look five minutes later at the chat, if anybody said it was too loud. So I probably just raped your ears for the third time. Um, oh well. <laughs> oh well, I suppose. Right, so we got Rose defending. They got four muskets out, four short swords, a couple of, well, three moles and a pole axe. Banished have got two muskets. It's a lot of short swords. A lot of short swords, yeah. That's not much hero killing. They'll, they'll be looking to get their they'll be looking to get their uh, hit, uh, units to do it won't they so oh, what we got yeah. straight off the bat we've got flames up for banished we've got shields probably to protect the flames defenders have got flames out as well as we predicted they got the Kaylee militia up as well they got a few palace guards few madows a banished lads the banished have outriders there we'll check this in a sec i think yeah, banished had outriders teams, i think too Oh, the keys on this sometimes do my nothing. Right. So this Scroll is out. two title winning houses going against each other, right? Yeah, so Banished were in the alliance that won on EU2 uh, last season, so season 10, and Rose were the leading house, I believe, for the winners on EU1, if I'm not mistaken. They were. Okay, so immediately. Banished her very close to the wall, and given the number yeah. of muskets, are taking a lot of free damage. Yeah. They're using their outriders to get rid of the wall by the looks of it. Wait, what's happened back here? And Frank has snuck over. And Frank snuck over, yeah, and his unit's getting stopped pushing the ram by a couple of the <laughs> Rose's units. But Anne Frank's getting a, a cheeky little cap off on B. No Has Rose seen it? Has no Rose hasn't seen it yet. I mean, Anne's probably chuckling now, I would have thought. And, that, and they're on A, Firecrackers, like, what's going on? <laughs> now they've seen it. Now they've seen it. Uh, Banished might be able uh, to capitalize on this, though. Like, if Rose pulled... Rose haven't... Rose have done the right thing. They didn't overreact there. So Firecracker died. Anne looks like he's going to be able to jump over the, the wall. The breach is now down. Um, they've lost 28 units, and that's probably all Outriders. Bubbles just died as well, so they've already pushed through the main gate. Let's zoom in on this. Oh, wrong button. Trees in the way. Oh, they're just getting side. shot from all sides as they go in. Yeah. I think this is when you push through A, like this, this, as I'm looking at it now, the right hand side, like the breach side, needs to be taken because otherwise there's you're just going to get hit from the side. Keshigs are going to be. Is that Hayachi? That is Hayachi. They look like yeah. they've got something to block there, right? Oh, they've got a pretty big push coming through this side. They've already got three, Single four guys coming through. It's just going to stop all of that. Because it's all cavalry. Over yes. this side, Banished have been stopped, though. Mm -hmm. Although they got rid of a lot of the units of Rose. Husband's just killed Bondit. They got rid of the Madal. It's just oh, that would be the Outriders. Yeah, that would be yeah, the Outriders, yeah. It's the first trap from yeah. Anished. Oh, that landed. The A side, they're just going to have to reset. Negative's being caught out. He's probably... Yeah, he's going to die, I reckon. Yeah, he's on his own. Firecracky Forbes is pulling back as well. So the A side's being cleared. The attackers have lost 200 units. The defender's like 140-ish. The fight's over at B at the minute, though. If Banish so can, if Banish can rotate quick enough to A now, are they about to keep pressure up on the B side though? I'm trying to see what's going on. Like, yeah, they've got partial caps off. That's a good one. A is fairly wide open at the minute. If Banish see this and can push in, they've already got the breach, they've got stuff in the gate. The longer they wait though, the quicker this stuff's gonna get down. They yeah, need to get like... It's just able to react to pressure at this point. Yeah. Benefits of defending, you've got a really short route. Banish starting to push in, there comes uh, a treb. That could be uh, a decent treb as well. Only there it goes. 
Yeah, Ooh. two of those land, I think. Three? Four? Yeah. That was lucky. I think they were lucky there. Only one got blocked. And now the big push they, is coming they, in they on A. Well they, they need to now push hard. So Keshigs have dealt with that guy. Negative needs to flank around the back. He is. Yeah. Um, there's, there's nobody at the B side, but Rose has left a couple over there as well. It's going fairly well for, oh, right, for Banish so spamming. far. The attackers have got a uh, Zakali militia up as well. They're getting the cap off, but I think Rose are just getting enough units, and I think they're gonna better push them off. Yeah, you go. Look from this breach side, they've they've just flanked around. Modao gonna push in. The Shenjins back here could do work though. I think it's Kriegs, right? Oh, that is Kriegs, right? Yeah, from Liam. Oof. I mean, if they get left alone though, they'll do work. And a single musket is distracting them. Yeah. They've been pushed off. Yeah, now the reinforcements come. Just yeah, they're pulling back though, so they don't lose all their heroes. It's a good treb. Which is a good shout. Yeah, that's a good treb. There's a unit on B, so Cosman's not going to be at a ninja cap. Um, Rose are sending a lot of dudes back to obviously get new units. Yeah, Cosman can't do ult back there. What unit is that that he's fighting against there? Yorkshire Pudding, how are you doing, bud? What is banished? It's the house I'm in. <laughs> now all the, the things are, that's why they're shit. Yeah, probably, let's be real. <laughs> I mean, they've nearly got A, so one decent push. Even just, what, for maybe five, ten seconds, and they get A. Unit-wise, Rose has got a hundred units less dead. <laughs> Completely said that wrong, but you know what I mean. If they can clear enough points, like clear them off enough to get A though. Not a single one of those tribes landed, unfortunately. Nah. Only a minute and a half left. Like this is. Yeah, they need, uh, they need to get time. in. They're doing a biggish push on B now, though. There's like four Imagine heroes up there. To come around the back and coordinate it with an A push, it will do work. But if it's on its own, it will just get stopped, like it is. Yeah. Yeah. I think there's enough at B though that they can maybe wipe B. There, Rose is pulling back to try and stop the B push. Banished is now on A though as well. I think Banished have a chance on A if they're quick. Yeah. They There's still got six enemy heroes though. Firecracker and Broken nice. up in it is push through and Cosman. It's got to get beyond the point. The B push is about FDS to get stopped, just I think. Wiped too. The SDS using Cav in it, yeah. I don't know, man. It's going to be close. I think they can do this. I think they can do it. There's too many short swords just not dealing enough damage. Yeah. I've got an eye on both of them to see, like, what's going on. I'll try keeping both on the side. Like, B's probably got less defenders on. Oh, a good one. They're winning FDS on A again. though as well. FDS playing really well. FDS is good, man. Like, um, he's he's pretty good. Like with his buddy cavalry, he is really good. Oh, just interrupted it. I think they'll get it though. They'll get A. A, a needs need, like half a second. Montecchi, they need to I think. Push fast yeah, that, here. they need to go. Yeah, they've got fast. A, so they've got time. They need to block the bridge. All oh, that cavalry. Do they have anything to stop it? Nope. Half a unit, Madow. Oh, yeah, that's not gonna do anything. I nah. think if Rose knew that I was only half a unit Madal, they'd keep going. Yeah, I think they've pulled back though. Um, they've pulled back with everything. B's now taken, but it's going to be a long drag. If they if if Rose defends C, this is going to be. I think they're pulling back though. A Rose pulling back. The B's about to get capped, they're on C, they are getting the dock as well. Uh, Hedda said this as well, I didn't actually know this. If you cap the dock before you capture C, the Berserkers just go to C and sit there and don't do anything. Yep. And it looks like they're going to get the dock before... Oh no! Yeah, the dock's going to get uh, taken before C is, so the, the, the Berserkers aren't going to help on the AI ones. Yep. Right, they've got six minutes for the end point, that's like a, a push, two pushes. Unit-wise, the attackers, it's roughly the same, 488 to 461. Um, the attackers have lost slightly more. They've still got eight trebs, though. 
it's how quickly can they get set up now and actually start pushing on. I'm going to have a look what units the defenders have got. They've got a couple of outriders. Oh no, one just got stopped out. They've got Madal. They've got a lot of Fort Brachio. Holy crap, they've got six sets of Fort Brachio up. Like, that is going to be a monster static defense. Yeah, so they've got on the, the eastern, sorry, the western side Fort Brachio. They've got the stairs Fort Brachio. Oh, please and... don't push small side. Please Ooh, don't both. push small side. Please don't. Yeah, they're moving a lot in that side. Oh, that was a good trev on the Fort Brachio, though. Lucky. They're putting pressure in on the east as well. Is that, oh, that's just... That's just my territory. They're not going to do it against Fort Brachios there. What they need up here to beat this really is like Shenjin or something to bomb it. Otherwise, they're not going to do ult. Or IPGs to walk it and then like units to kill them. That uh, trev should work. Do you know what I kind of oh, like no. that Banished have done here, though? It's because, they, because they're spreading out and attacking from multiple directions. It's like... Rose can't coordinate everything. Do you know what I mean? It's like it's a really scrappy fight. Mm, but there's ten dead for blue. Uh, ten yeah. dead for banished right now. So I mean five dead. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, five dead. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be a reset here. Yeah, they're gonna have to. They get. They. They still got time maybe for one push. They definitely had the worst of that. And I'm saying that's only thirty difference. Twenty thirty difference. I think they know that it pushing the, the little side, though, the west side is going to be more difficult. And Rose have pushed everything over to the east, though. The problem is if Banish try going to the west side again, you can see them. Like, so they'll see them rotate, and obviously Rose have got, like, the tiniest distance that they have to move. You also Here we can't go. get Cav up there, which is one of the major no. problems. Yeah. Banish have got a lot of peasants out as well. I saying that a lot of peasants. Woodcutters and Matelitori. Village Watchman for Rose. Rose have just pushed my Dow in. That grenade was good though. Uh, it was a short sword. Was that a sh Was it? Yeah, FTS. Oh, was that FTS light, weren't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two sets of Fort Brachio there, they were going to be difficult. So we've got the main push coming this way. I feel like that Treb could be Big very treb. good. Yeah, they didn't have the numbers to, to make them stay there though, so the rest of them are basically hitting nothing. Uh, the yeah. far north here is getting pushed back. Banished to dying and Rose are staying alive. Yeah. Unit wise, it's 60 difference, 70 difference now. This northern side, it's, they can't do anything up here. They can, literally can't do anything up there. That's, if there's somebody's alive with a treb, oh, they pulled back. That would have been a good treb, though. IX Ho Ho in the background. I don't, I don't know what he's doing back there, but he's getting stun locked the crap out of. Forbes is trying to get through. Spanish need to reset and yeah. form up for a final push. They've got time for maybe one more. I don't know if they've got the quality anymore, though. But Shenzhen's out. They've got Iron Reapers could do work. They've got Javelins, uh, Imperial Spear Guards. They, they, I don't think they've got the units to deal with the six sets of Fort Brachio. And there's four sets of Modao out as well, man. I think Rose, no. Look, Rose are going to push them down, I think. I think Rose are going to counter him. Cosman's in the background, but I don't think he's got any more units. He doesn't have any more units. Like having six sets of Fort Brachio up though, and multiple sets of Modal, that was... Without having anything like Shenjins to grenade them or shoot them. not going to hit anything. Nah. What were they aiming for there? Or do you reckon that was a misclick or something? That, that must have been a misclick. 40s on top. Yeah, that like half a unit, but that's... Oh, well, the Broken and Rue gonna get rid of them now. Okay, back backside has got through. Yeah. Oh, they've, they've only got trash there though, so they're not gonna do much. This Treb could be good. Ooh, good damage. Yeah, that that hit a lot of Fort Brachio as chance. well. It's unfortunately only 10 alive still. Yeah, I don't think they do. They've they've got like one good unit out, maybe two. The the, the western side's now. been completely stopped. They are down at eight. And the Fort Brachios managed to do, do too much damage. Like you can see Rose straight away, they have them set up, and then as soon as like the fight starts getting scrappy, they just V-attack all of them and they just insta-melt all the heroes. And it doesn't make a difference if you've got iron sides up. If you've got like four sets of Fort Brachios stacked on top of each other, V-attacking, you're gonna die. There's three left alive, so you've got negative firecracker and Damyam in the back of there. Damyam's literally getting hunted by all of Rose. Like, literally. <laughs> <laughs>
I mean, that was a good attack, man, to be fair. They did, they did very well. Oh, they did, because, like... Look at the Berserkers doing work on C. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think... Like, I didn't know that until Hedda said it, that they just sit there unless you cap the thing. I don't think they would have done much, though, because they had... Rose had so many Fort Abrachios up, they would have just run straight into the front of them and insta-died. Yeah. So it wouldn't have really made any difference whatsoever. So Fox is getting annihilated now on the stairs. He's having a good time with Rose over here, look. Just cutting some... Or he was cutting some shapes until the shapes were cut out of him. Got bubbles up here being terrible. Look, oh, kill him, kill him. He's he's died. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> he's, he's died. He's five times this game. Bubbles, you crap. <laughs> the thing is though, with with bubbles, he gets like proper in, stuck in the fights. Like it's none of this like sitting back general in thing. He's like literally like mm. just rolls his face over his keyboard and runs straight in. Whilst licking his space bar, that's what I've heard at least. I wonder what my job's going to be next territory war. <laughs> I don't. Cl I know exactly what your job will be next territory war. Cleaning toilets, I reckon. <laughs> well, GG Rose. Well, GG, GG yeah. banished as well, man. Like, that was some good fighting. And sh yeah, big shout out to good. FDS. FDS did work, man, with those Keshigs when he had them out. Um, look at all the S ranks for Rose, man, though. Like, all bar four. Good, good work. That, yeah, that setup so on the end point, though, was... Tasty with like yeah. six fort abrachia. What I kept seeing was banished heroes dying 